brand new from Ford. Tell us a little bit about it, Heather. Wow, well, uh, this is called, hang on, I've got to get this right. Ford Fiesta Bengali. We think Correct. that that's how you pronounce it's it. A bit of like a, it sounds like a bit of an Italian name, doesn't yes, it? Yes. It's uh, a bit sporty. Finale, I think. Vin 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 it's a very nice car with this nice it's champagne snazzy. colour. It's really snazzy. It's got all the features on here, some amazing detailing on the outside uh, for a car, especially this size. It is, I have to keep kidding myself because I have to keep reminding myself because my first car was a Ford Fiesta. Believe me, it was nothing. Didn't look anything like nothing this. Nothing like none this. Of those features, did it? No. Wind up windows? Uh, yeah. 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 It had wind up windows, and that was about it. This has got these amazing alloy wheels. It's also got front and rear parking sensors, a rear parking camera as well, which we'll have a look at. And you can see the kind of uh, detailing. There's an awful lot of thought that's gone into this. Uh, and I have to keep reminding myself that this is a Ford Fiesta. Uh, coming around the back here, uh, for a family, it's kind of ideal. You know, as a, as a car for a family, there's room easily for three people. Now, it's Heather is nearly six foot seven. You go and sit in the back there. Come on, let, let's give this a go, shall we? Yeah, go and let's sit in the back, see how you get on. Where, where's your head at? I'm good. Do you know what, I'm good. You've got a bit of headroom there and as well, haven't you? It's got a comfy seat here as well. It's quite spongy, but a bit sporty at the same time. Also, can I just say, I'm loving this. The, the huge sunroof. You don't often get that on cars these days, do you? Or is no. that like a new feature? Yeah, that is a very, very, and it's a huge sunroof. Yeah, it's well. massive. I think it goes all the way back up here. Oh, I think this moves. Hang on a minute, kids. Check that out. Oh, I'm loving that. That's really good. Okay, uh, let's have a look around here. And this is the boot. Again, for the size of car, yeah. that is a really good boot size. Uh, you'd be able to get quite a few cases in there and also a little little secret cubby hole down there where you've got all your bits and pieces that you need, including this. It took me ages to work out what that was. Apparently it's for the oil. It's to put the oil in, don't get confused. Uh, right, uh, what else have we got? You could fit a buggy in here, can I just say? As yeah. a mum, you could fit a buggy in there quite easily. And you've got the split of seats as well, so they fold down, giving you quite a nice large bit of luggage area. Let's go and have a look at the toys that it's got on it. Oh, here we go. The exciting bit for Mr. Paul Topping here. Oh, first of all, can you turn the air con on, please? Yes, we'll get, the, we'll get oh, the air con on. It's a bit warm in here. We have this massive yeah, sunroof up. up here. Uh, I think I might need to take this bit back up here as well so that you can see how far it goes back. There you go. That That is oh, really lovely. a very impressive oh, sunroof like there. Uh, you've also got all sorts of stuff on the display. Uh, let's see, rear right door open. Where is it? Where's the door open? Oh, let's close that. There we go. There we go. So on here, it's going to actually look and tell you um, the, the read the road signs and tell you the speed that you should be going at. It's got all sorts of stuff on here, including, including the standard stuff like cruise control, voice activation. You can control your phone from it. Uh, it really is feature packed, and it looks like on here as well that it does have. Uh, the lane system as well. So if you're doing long driving, maybe you're going on holiday to France or something like that, and you're doing a massive long drive, if you veer out of the lane, it will let you know oh. and tell you you need to get oh, back into the lane. Yeah, it's got, amazing. Okay. It's got loads That's of handy. other features on here. Now, um, down here, lots of different things. It's got the eco feature, which is really good. It means that if you get stuck in traffic a lot and you've got that on, as soon as you come to a halt, put the car in yes, neutral and it switches the engine off which saves you quite a bit of fuel in fact it's amazing how much it does save you heated steering wheel heated seats air conditioning with full digital display this massive screen as well that uh, links in with uh, your iPhone uh, also you can do loads of bits and pieces go to the settings and you'll f I could play with this for hours Hours could, and hours. You? Yeah, I could. could. I could. This would make me happy. <laughs> if I put this in reverse, this would make me happy. You can have a little look. I don't know whether it will do it. Oh, hold on. How do I what? go? Hang out? on. Can we go let's, back? Let's go back. How do I uh, get back from here? Okay. Uh, let's try that. Nope. Let's go to that. Let's go to that. Shouldn't... Oh no, that's not oh, reverse. I was going to say. There, sure we there we go. There we go. Look at this. So you have the full reverse there, and uh, if we, uh, I'll just check. There's nothing behind, uh, so you can actually see. 
and the great thing with these is it will actually show you where it's going to go technology so, these days so for someone like me it, yeah. it really is uh it really is good why me because i'm pretty incompetent with most things including driving i don't know what this plus does oh, oh look a bit of a zoom in function let's go forwards now and it should there we go tell me when i'm getting close but i'm not going to risk it and this has the full bang and offs and um stereo in it so we won't play any music but uh, the best thing to do is to come down to the motor show. When's it happening, Heather? It's happening this Saturday and Sunday at Haven Street, 10 o'clock kickoff. Love this.